guys, I have finally finished all of my back to school supply shopping. So I wanted to show you everything that I've purchased for the new school year. If you guys are excited for my back to school supplies giveaway, make sure to give this video a thumbs up to let me know. And I will try to link everything that I bought in the description box down below. First, I got this 24 pack of the Pilot Juice Pens. And these are in the 0.38 millimeter size. Um, if you guys have seen my Battle of the Pens video, you know that these are my absolute favorite gel pens. I swear by them, especially as a lefty, they never smear and never bleed through paper, so I would highly recommend these. I really, really love them, which is why I got the 24 pack. So next, I got a new pencil case. As you guys know, I already have the Kipling 100 pen case, which I find to be a really, really huge pen case for me to take to class and the periodic table one that I got from coolpencilcase.com. That one's a little bit too small, so I found this was a really nice, happy medium. I have slots for pens to go um, on the front part, and if you flip it over, there are little elastic like net compartments that you can fit in things like erasers or flash drives or whatever. Um, if you guys want to see an updated what's in my pen case video, make sure to let me know in the comments down below. Next, I managed to find this set of five black Muji hexagon ballpoint pens in the .38 size, and I actually really, really like these. I had one from my Muji haul, but um, it's starting to run out of ink, and I really like using it for annotating. As many of you already know, I typically use expandable file folders to organize my schoolwork instead of binders, which I explained in a previous video, but basically, I repurchased a bunch of these six pocket expanding files from Mead 5 Star in a bunch of awesome colors So I'm super excited to start labeling them with all my classes and everything like that next is another repurchase I got this value pack of these post-it flags and I also got some post-it page markers Both of which I will use while annotating books since I'm taking AP literature next year I know I have to do a lot of reading so these two will definitely come in handy Next, I have three spiral notebooks all in different prints that I will be using for class and it's nice that I can fit all of these inside of my expanding file folder so that makes it really convenient for me. Next is one of my absolute favorite things about going back to school which is getting a new backpack. I got this L.L. Bean Super Deluxe one and it is the same one that I had last year just in a different color. There are tons of compartments and I know for a fact that all of my stuff will fit in perfectly and I will most likely be doing an updated what's in my backpack video as soon as school starts so let me know in the comments if you guys are excited about that I got two of these college ruled composition notebooks from five star and typically I'll put these inside of my expandable folders that I use for class for back to school, I also got a pack of 4x6 index cards and a new eraser. This is the Stedler Mars plastic one, and I think it works really, really well. Although I do use expandable file folders in almost all of my classes, there's one class that I do use a 2-inch binder for, and it's my AP calculus class just because I do like to flip back and forth between my notes rather often and all of the papers that I get from my teachers are always hole punched so I never have a problem staying organized in that way but other than this class I do use all of my expandable file folders so with any binder of course you do need dividers I got this set of five dividers for just a dollar at the Target dollar spot and guys look at these patterns they're so so cute um, they don't feel very sturdy, so I'll probably have to tape them up to make them more sturdy, but nonetheless, I'm excited to set up everything. So these next two items I probably will not open right away, but I got a 20 pack of the Stedler Tri Plus Fineliners. If you've seen my Battle of the Fineliners video, you know that these are my absolute favorites. And I also got these Stedler Text Surfer highlighters that I'm excited to try out, but I will probably just open both of these like on a special occasion or if I'm like feeling down throughout the year. So I just have them and I will keep them in my desk until I open them. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. 
Subscribe to my YouTube channel because I post videos every Sunday, Wednesday, and Friday. You can add me on Snapchat and follow me on my Instagram and Tumblr account. Bye guys!